Ready. Ready. <laughs> what, you actually filmed? Yeah, I am. <laughs> Today is a very exciting day as you can tell from me clapping my hands like a weirdo. I am off to Ingatestone Saddlery Centre today and I'm going to spend money that I do not have. <laughs> no, I'm joking, I can't do that because I literally have no money. But I'm taking some friends to Ingatestone just to have a look around and I thought I'd take you guys with me so you can see what they have on offer and uh, yeah, just come for a little day out with me. Peps is out in the field enjoying the beautiful sunshine. Where is she? You can see her ass. <laughs> oh yeah, there. <laughs> Let's get to it. Look who I'm with! Dutchie, oh. come here. Give me a kiss. Dutchie's kiss. I give you one anyway. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's so. Oh my god, I just hit him in the chin. Oh. I'm so sorry. Oh, he still loves me. He's fine. He's fine. Hi, Lee. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know what this is focusing on, but it's fine. Aww. Hello! Hi! <laughs> We're going in Gatestone, I'll see you in a bit, yeah? Okay? Bye, Bye. Walking to Ingate's door. Hey, We're gonna walk in and be like, what you doing? Ooh. Oh. This actually doesn't open automatically, which is a shame. <laughs> I'm gonna fill this trolley up.
you this is more my area the sale rack I'm actually loving this design right now but it's a six foot why is my pony so big why don't they have the cleaner they've got the conditioner oh, that's what I need thank you very much <clears throat> that is also going on the trolley I'm not meant to be spending money today. I have one of these nails. They're so soft. Aren't they nice? Touch it. Pink! Pink! You said that really loud. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I didn't realise you could use this on what? Camels. Camels. Goats. Goats. Alpacas. Pigs. Pigs. Sheep. <laughs> Francesca! <laughs> <laughs> Where did that knife go? <laughs> oh god! It's so fluffy, I'm gonna die! Thank you very much. Yay! <laughs> pink hay nets. You getting some? Of course she is. It's very pink. <laughs> it is very, very pink. There's a less pink on this side. Like a bit more of a tame pink. Yeah. To be honest, though, that vibrant pink uh, fades after a while. Anyway, this is like in your face pink, and then you've got. These are not in your face because it's it's not. Then it is. Is not. Is not. <laughs> is not. So it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> Beads broom. <laughs> Aww. Aww. So our um, trolley is already full. Just gonna point that out. Eek. I'm obsessed with <laughs> Jade. So we are well and truly shopped out. Where's Jade? Jade's just spent a lot of money. <laughs> uh, in Rachel's car. Hi. I just went to um, I just went to Ingo Stone. Right. With uh, Rachel and Jade. I won't go into buy anything, but I bought like, loads of stuff. I'm not telling Gareth. <laughs> I think this truck looks like a lion. Yeah. Can you see it? Two eyes at the top, nose yeah. is a square part, mouth is the bottom bit, yeah. and then the round lock, like round bit, is mine. It's me, yeah. I think that's so cool. I can see it now. Roar. <laughs> <laughs> Roar, I'm a lion. <laughs> I'm a majestic lion. <laughs> Film him, not me. <laughs> He's a lion. <laughs> I'm just on my way to see my play. Hi guys, so we're back from Ingate Stone and we thought we would do a little tack haul for you guys to show you what we've bought. I say we, mostly Jade. <laughs> <laughs> I've not really bought like, this is my stuff and she's got like a lot more. Yeah. So, <laughs> so much I can't even lift it. <laughs> do we go through yours first or mine? I go through yours because it's less. Okay. Well, I'll start with like the most exciting thing, which is this. I saw this at the last minute and it's got dinosaurs on it, which is definitely a bit of me. And yeah, I thought I could use it as my new hat bag. Not that I really needed a new hat bag, but dinosaurs! <laughs> so, yep, that's that. Okay, so both of us got socks. Some new socks. <laughs> Mine were reduced, so they were only 6 35 for two pairs. And they've got a little fox on, they're so cute. Yeah, yeah. Mine, them. mine are just thin ones for summer. Yeah. Keep nice and cool. But so yeah. you've got Lemure and Wolfwear ones there. Yeah, so I've got two, two Lemure, which are them ones, and a double pack of, of Wolfwear as well. I've got these in the pink and I find them really comfortable, so I thought I'd get some more in a different colour. And like you say, nice and thin for the summer. Yeah. But they're nice when you're wearing long boots as well, because it just means that it's easier to do your long boots up, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, means you, all your let, uh, jods don't uh, ruffle up. And we've both got a tack cleaner and a tack conditioner. 
Um, so these are great for just cleaning your tack basically and then the conditioner just keeps everything nice and lubricated. <laughs> moist! <laughs> moist! Oh, man, why? Kiss it moist! <laughs> If you can't tell already, I don't like that word. Yeah, Jay doesn't. We'll insert a clip from earlier today in Gatestone where we were just teasing her for yeah. not liking the word. So, Jade needs something to uh, moisten Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> her boots. We've both got hoof picks. <laughs> can't tell our favourite colours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> most of my stuff is purple and you'll see that most of the stuff that Jade's got. <laughs> Actually all the pretty much all the stuff I think is all pink. The stuff I got is pink. Yeah. yeah. And they were one pound forty five? Yeah. It's alright, isn't it? Not bad, not bad. Okay. Um I've only got two more, thank you, so I'll just finish with that. Um I've mentioned this in my vlogs before but I really like these well I don't like them. <laughs> Peps likes the <laughs> Uncle Jimmy's um stuff but this is actually a no added sugar one and i just thought with spring coming and the spring grass coming through this would be better than the ones that do have sugar in so there's that and the last thing was these uh acavello gel bit guards and this is just for her bit obviously <laughs> um but her bit is just slipping through her mouth a little bit because it's just a loose ring it is the right size for her as, as far as I'm aware but it's just moving about a bit too much so yeah and I like these ones because they don't rub as much in the summer when she starts getting sweaty and stuff unlike the plain rubber ones I feel really rub them so that's it that's my haul for the day I, I've got a few more <laughs> yeah just a few <laughs> Um, so I basically mainly got a grooming kit, so I've got a uh, lone horse, He's, I've just got it on full loan. Um, had her for three months, just got her a, a brand new grooming kit, and as you're going to tell, it's, it's pretty much all pink. Um, <laughs> so I've got a easy groom main and Basically, anything that she couldn't get in pink, she just had to get another colour. Yeah, but... I was a bit gutted by that. Yeah, really. and this, I actually went out of my way to find a pink yeah. one for her. I was like, which I luckily they did. <laughs> yeah, sorry, so go on. Uh, yeah, because I've been mainly using a plastic curry comb, which doesn't go through her hair as well. So I thought I'd give this a try. Awesome. And that was, well, should we, oh, we yeah. we'll do prices for you guys. Uh, that was £4.50, so not bad at all, yeah. actually. Yeah, because I'm not sure if it works out cheaper to buy things online, including like postage, do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, I mean, I think if you're getting a very large amount, it'd probably be worth it because your, your yeah. postage would be combined. But, but then I suppose getting... when you consider fuel, is it really much of a difference? I don't know. I don't know. I think I online know. shopping probably is a bit cheaper. Yeah, but I, I feel that... But you can go in there and you get the physical yeah. thing straight away. It's right there. I find as well, like, when you go in... Like, when you look online, you never get everything you need because you don't yeah. see stuff. Where you walk around and stuff, like, oh, I, I need to grab that and yeah. spend more money. <laughs> <laughs> Which is what I definitely Quite did a today. lot of money, yeah. <laughs> um, so I got a little Uh Is it... Is it what's it called? What's it called? Officially, what's it called? Oh, it is a, a military curry comb. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Yep, just for cleaning my brushes. Yeah. Because the ones I have at the moment are very dirty. Um, I also got the uh, Easy Groom Dandy Brush. Just nice stiff brush for like just getting the dirt off. Yep. Yeah. And I had to get it matching, of course. And this was three ninety five, which is pretty good actually. Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Not bad at all. Um, I also got the same one <laughs> in the. Uh, Body brush, the easy groom. As you can tell, I like the colours. They're pretty, <laughs> and they match. Uh, that is pretty pink. Yeah, and all the bristles are different coloured pinks as well, so it's quite nice. And I'm not sure how pink they'll stay, but yeah. they're pretty for the moment. So that's <laughs> that matters. And that one was four pound fifty, which isn't bad actually. No, there was definitely some like more expensive, more brushes, expensive yeah. ones, but they're nice. They're, they're a nice feel, which is what I mainly care about. I don't really yeah. mind about the price as long as it's, it's good. As long as it works, <laughs> exactly. So I got the. Diva finishing one finishing brush. Yeah. Diva girly brush. I have this for Peps as well. Yeah. And I honestly I really do swear by these Haas brushes. I think they're absolutely amazing. Um Peps has the dark base set, but I bought the pink diva brush just because well, I already had a diva brush, but it's pink and it's got a tiny little pink bow on I it. I mean how freaking right here, cute so is cute. that? And it, and it feels amazing. It does so. feel amazing. It's like I think it's lamb's wool. Yeah, I think yeah. it said uh, lamb's wool on there. Yeah, <laughs> I was going to say, being a vegetarian, you probably don't like that very much, but oh well. But, but Rita will have it. Yeah. <laughs> It'll make Rita super glossy. I then got the, uh, just the comb for when I'm plaiting, so I've just started plaiting her tail. 
um, but she's got quite a lot of uh, loss, hair loss on yeah. it, where her, 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 her uh, rugs are uh, rubbing. Her, 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 her. I don't know. <laughs> rubbing a little bit so I'm waiting for that to grow out but I'm hopefully going to try and plait her mane so I thought that'd be an ideal thing to buy mm -hmm. and of course I had to get the pink plaiting bands pink um, pink <laughs> literally when she picked these up it was like pink and the people in the shop were like what I think, I think that was a bit shocked <laughs> I'm really gutted um, I had to get the red face, face brush, brush. Yeah. I didn't say how much those were the Diva brush was £19.75, which obviously is pricey, but honestly, for the quality, I think it's worth it. And that yeah. was... This one was 60p. Oh, Can't sweet. For that. Yeah. Um, and these were 80p. And I think it comes off with 100 There was a bigger box there, but for just playing around, these were, and, and the other box wasn't pink. Yeah. But for playing around, <laughs> these are perfectly fine. Basically, she didn't get them because they weren't pink. But. Yeah, I mean, I'll be honest. <laughs> I'm saying that these, these were a smaller, more reasonable pack, but no, they weren't pink, so I didn't want <laughs> um, But yeah, the face brush was really gutted. Ha had to be red, because I didn't have pink, which is really sad, but she needed it. And I know, I'll just go back and buy a pink one at some point anyway. <laughs> um, and this was 175 for a, and it went, it's quite soft actually, because, um, got quite a sensitive face sometimes. Yeah, it's soft but it's like stiff enough so that you can still get the dirt off. Yeah, but not, not enough to, to uh, hurt a face at all. So, to carry all my new uh, grooming kit in, she's got a little uh, grooming kit box, 1795. 95. It's pretty good actually because it's got the double clip and inside it's got the the tray and also a hoof foil, hoof oil holder. Which is pretty cool, which obviously slides on the side. And it's big enough for all my brushes and it's it's pink and black, so it's yes. not too like ah, it's pink. Yeah, I didn't want I didn't want everyone to think you know I just got pink stuff, so I had to do a <laughs> bit of black. Everything on the inside <laughs> is in your face pink, but, but but no one needs to see in the inside, just me. So <laughs> I got that. It's quite reasonable and it's sturdy enough. Awesome. So that'll do its job. So I also got the absorbing, yeah, absorbing uh, show shine. You recommended this to me actually because yep. uh, Rita's towel is quite dry and her mane's really dry as well. Um, and just kind of get some shine in her coat because she's quite dull yeah, at the moment. Yeah, that even says, so it's got pro vitamins, nourish coat, silk protein, strengthens mane and tail, repels dust and dirt. And, and I've only camel. recently kind of, <laughs> you can use it on camels, <laughs> as we learned in the shop. But yeah, um, I've only just started using this on peps, but you've seen her coat is like, it's, it's, really it's, it's, it's literally gleaming. And, and, and her tail's really soft. Yeah. So. And Rita just really suffers from quite a dull coat. Yeah. Um, but it's mainly for her mane and towel. I just want to kind of get that into a better condition. Yeah. Because every time I'm brushing it, it's kind of snapping. So I'm hoping I'll give this a go and let you know how I get on. Awesome. <laughs> so I also got two of these. So I got, I think they were the deluxe ones. Yeah, the deluxe uh, hay net, pink and black. I mean, I couldn't just go for pink. So we've got some pink and black in there as well. <laughs> um, but they're quite a nice, nice size. And they're the thin, thin holes as well because... She's a greedy girl. She's very, very greedy. Um, but yeah, so how much were they? I think they were £8.15. Uh, £8.10 each. So £8.10, not... that's not bad. And for the deluxe ones as well, because I see that they've got the ring at the bottom. Yeah. Um, as opposed to gather, because when it's when it's gathered, I can never get the, the hay yeah. in properly because it just just doesn't sit right. And I'm that's by the... KM Elite, these ones. Yeah. So yeah, they're quite nice. I've got two of those. Um, I also got two uh, new pink feed buckets. These this, are... I must admit, was my fault because I yeah. kind of like, they were buried at the bottom of the pile and they were two pink ones and I was like, Jade, 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 have it. <laughs> and like, they all kind of came flying at you. I was like, them at me. <laughs> that was not intentional, <laughs> but yeah, you've got to have them. Yeah, and, and I'll, the ones I was having was breaking anyway, so yeah. I thought, well, you can't buy one and have an odd coloured, so we got two. <laughs> um, so yeah, but they were... Four pounds fifty, 50 each. Yeah, that's not bad. and they're forty liters as well, so they're they're a nice decent size, and they're, they're big enough for a feed because she's got yeah. quite quite a big face. So anything smaller, she just gets stuck <laughs> in there. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so they were. They were I actually they were a that spot. just reminded me, like just to sidetrack a little bit because we're not already. Oh, that's so sweet. Um, never mind, ignore that, you can't see it, but that was cute. <laughs> it was cute anyway. It's a bit so of fun. liberty, a bit of horsemanship there. But just trust on. us. <laughs> <laughs> um, but we had um, a cat once who, like, me and my mum had stayed in bed together for some reason because my dad was still in South Africa at the time, I believe, so it was just me and my mum and my brother. And I was, take, like, it, this was years and years ago, and I was, like, struggling to kind of settle into school and stuff, so I was still like, mummy. Um, and we'd sat it up in bed eating, like, biscuits, and we'd gone to sleep, woken up the next morning to, like, this rattling, and we were like, what is going on? We turned around, the cat's got the biscuit wrapper <laughs> stuck over its head. 
<laughs> oh, just wandering just around. It was literally like, oh. <laughs> how long would it have been stuck like that? I don't know. <laughs> it can't have been long because we woke up as soon as we heard it. it teaches it to go down, down back, it's really just near. <laughs> okay, what else have we got? Right, so I also... We're got, running out of daylight. I know. I got some new Arik gloves. I got a pair before and accidentally lost them. Um, but they, these were quite pricey, but I prefer the suede innards um, as opposed to like the leather feel and I really don't like the bobbling. Um, so these were 32.75, but they're really good quality and they fit really well. So I've got quite short fingers. Um, so I always find the, um, the fingers holes always overlap my fingers and just not comfortable. And these literally fit like, like a glove. A glove. <laughs> I don't know where that come back saying comes from. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm quite excited to try these out. Yes, we've got, we're still going. We've, we've also got some more brushes. <laughs> as if I didn't have enough. Um, so I bought the um, the original Magic Brush triple set. But this is the Valentine's version. I mean... Pink. It's pink. That's why I got it. That is purely so, the only reason why. I mean, it's not too late for Valentine's. It's never too late for Valentine's. Um, but this is actually a really good deal. It's £13.30 for all three. Um, and I, just, I, I tried out your one I really really liked to get all of the, all the um, mud off the mud and it does bring some hair out as well yeah, yeah it's, and she, she's I think so they're hairy. just fantastic for mud especially yeah obviously wait until the mud's dried off but you can really get in there and like the bristles are just like they're stiff but they're not hard yeah, are they because they do bend yeah and move with yeah, but they I don't know I don't know why they work, but they work really well. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, I'm ever since I tried yours I'm I'm in I'm in love with it, yeah. so and and the pink which is I mean bonus. the bristles do give eventually, but I think that's why they do these sets of three so that they last a bit longer for you. Yeah, and to be fair, I mean for thirteen pounds thirty for three brushes, I mean that only works at maybe like four pounds each. Yeah. To be fair, I had each. one of them for like three years before I bought a new one, so Yeah and, and they still worked. The brush, br bristles might get a bit bent, but as you say, there's three in a pack, so you yep. can't really go wrong for that. <laughs> We've got some good muffins! Yeah! So, Rita tried one from your Valentine's Day... Um, yeah, my Valentine's Day vlog. And she absolutely loved them, so saw them in the, the aisle as we was leaving, you know, as if I didn't spend enough money. So, yeah, um, I, if you missed the Valentine's Day vlog, I will link it in the description below. Um, but I basically did, like, a tray of stud muffins as a Valentine's Day, like, chocolate box for horses. And uh, Stud Muffins, actually, I sent them the link to the video and they really liked it and they were kind enough to gift me with one of their new celebration cakes, which is, um, it's in my car and I wish I'd thought about this like half an hour ago because <laughs> I could have shown it in the video. Um, but I actually had already bought one, so I now have two celebration cakes and I thought we might do a horsey tea party. Yes, because we have two horses. <laughs> yes, uh, well, uh, uh, we don't need to give them a Stud Muffin cake each, <laughs> no. let's face it. No, we'll do like, we'll have a few ponies and yeah, we'll see if we can get people involved and see if that's actually a realistic video, but I would actually love that, like That'd little, be amazing. little cakes and sandwiches and stuff. Some tea, like, some like afternoon tea, yes. oh my god, this oh, so that'd be so good. <laughs> yeah, anyway, so do you remember how much they were? Because I don't think they've got a price on them. I don't even think I checked. I think there was only a few pounds though, there wasn't that much. Lastly absolutely love this yeah i so, actually spotted this and i was like oh my god it's so beautiful yes and i needed it so it's just a new area top but i love the colors of it i think it's really spring and summer yeah it is definitely. um so i've got a black one of these um but i just i loved it i, ha I had to buy it so it's, you've got like it's not even like a navy blue it's like a dusty blue mm. midnight blue and then a light blush pink which is gonna go so nice with your oh new mimeo matchy so excited. <laughs> I didn't even think about that at the time. But yeah, that is a blush pink on the And on that's the, the, the matchy set I'm going to get. Yeah, and it was only £34, so very reasonably priced. Yeah. Good for wearing down the yard. and quite. I'm, I'm expecting it to be quite cool for summer as well. Yeah. As the summer comes in. The sleeves are quite short on these as well, so you're not like... It's quite airy, I suppose, when you're riding. And then tan lines. And tan lines, <laughs> yeah. A nice old farmer's tan, <laughs> which all of us equestrians are familiar with. Like, we've got, like, tanned ankles. <laughs> Tan ankles, tan arms, everywhere else. tan face, and then it's just white. <laughs> you go on holiday and everyone goes, what just are you? see I'm through. A like, oh, I can see through that. <laughs> <laughs> you're so white, you're translucent. <laughs> yeah. So that was our that was our haul. Yep. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with us today at Ingotstone. Um, yeah, it was lots of fun. Bit silly. Did yeah. think we were going to get kicked out, but we didn't, so it's fine. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget you can hit the subscribe button below and I'll also have my Instagram linked below as well where I sort of 
interact with you guys a little bit, see what vlogs you do and don't want to see and kind of get ideas from you guys as well. Jade needs to start an Instagram, am I right? And vlogging. <laughs> like down below if you think Jade needs to start doing this with me. Um, yeah, it's been great having you guys join us. So until next time, see you later. Bye guys. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs>